Of all the rescue calls this rescue team deal with, deer can be some of the most dangerous. The rescuer Simon was recently called to help free a male roe deer after he had become tangled in plastic fencing. Whilst luckily the netting wasn't tight and there was no risk of constriction injury, hopefully it's going to be a very quick rescue release. After some manipulations with scissors, the poor fellow was free. So now the deer can return to his life. Around two dozen cats were rescued from burning apartments. Firefighters then found and rescued all these cats. They were so scared and wet. Poor babies. Now they're all safe, thanks to the firefighters. A curious fox got its head stuck in a sewer grate. Fortunately, people noticed her very quickly. The fox was released back into the same place she was found. Go back to your wild home and don't do it again. There are a few stories of animal rescues in Turkey after the big earthquake. Everyone needs help in this difficult situation, and animals are no exception. One eyewitness video showed emergency workers rescuing a dog from under the rubble. A small dog named Pamuk waited patiently as first responders dug him by hand out from earthquake rubble in Turkey. It took some time, but Pamuk was finally pulled free of the wreckage. Hopefully, the little dog's rescue will give his human family another reason to fight and recover. Rescuers found a dog that got himself wedged in a concrete drainage pipe. He was injured and absolutely terrified. He wasn't trustworthy and wanted to stay in that tube, and he couldn't be sure that the people were there to help him. After a few unlucky attempts, they managed to get him out. Now he can see his rescuers. They moved him directly and safely to the vet. He is an older boy with poor eyesight. Also, he can't smell and can't hear very well. The x-rays showed no broken bones, but he had some shots. Such a poor creature. He needs to stay in the hospital for a while. After a week, he started to feel better, and he was ready to leave the clinic. He got a name, Eris. This boy will remain under care of this rescue team. He will make sure he will have a good life for as long as it takes. Animals also need a decent old age. One cold winter day, a small cat was found buried in the snow by a kind-hearted rescuer. She was frozen and stressed out. The rescuer rushed her to the nearest animal hospital, where the staff worked tirelessly to save her life. After a month of treatment and care at the clinic, she made a full recovery and was ready to come back into a happy kitty life. She was lucky enough to be adopted by a family who could provide her with all the love and care she needed to feel happy and loved. A lot of animals were rescued from shelling in Irpin. Unfortunately, their owners could not take them out from the shelling. They tried to save their lives. However, under enemy fire, the man collected abandoned animals. During the day, risking his own life, he saved about 30 cats and several dogs. Now all these cuties are in safety. This unlucky raccoon wanted to eat some treats from the can and got stuck in there. Thank God people noticed him. Hey. Ooh, gotta hurt, gotta hurt. People caught him and started the release operation. It was kind of tricky. The scared raccoon was about to bite. How's he doing after all this adventure? Fortunately, he was pretty healthy. Hey there, little guy. Rescuers gave him some water and an apple to eat. That's good to have a snack after such stress. Maybe he was really grateful. The raccoon ran away to his wildlife, healthy and happy. Hope for Paws rescue team got a call about a cat family in a drain. The babies were there alone without their mom. So the rescuers handled the tiny kittens one by one. They tried to use the kittens to lure the mom into a trap, but unsuccessfully. The kittens at this point were really hungry, so the rescuers took them home to be fed and keep them warm. A few weeks later, Zazu, Rafiki, King, Tifu, and Serafina are really happy to be safe in a foster home. They're waiting for their best future with a loving family. Look how this man saved a poor cat stuck in a car bonnet. This story has a happy end, the cat is safe. 
This unfortunate dog was spotted in the breach of a bombed out bridge. He fell into a hole and miraculously survived. Caring people called for help, and the rescuers got the dog out from under the bridge. The grateful puppy finally met his savior. When the boy was risen to the surface, he also received a tasty treat. It's so nice to see the care of people towards animals. Hope for Paws received a call about a very nervous homeless dog. So volunteers started to try and catch her. She was so aggressive that it could be dangerous. She was hiding and was really angry about the people around her. The situation was extremely dangerous and hard. They decided to act very slowly. Luckily, she was hungry and finally they could catch her. Afterwards, they had to deal with a much harder mission, to put the dog into a cage. As the shelter workers were prepared for that complicated case, they used a fake arm to calm her down and got used to a human arm. So it was cool to see her wagging tail for the first time. Look at this happy dog now. Be good, Maddie. This tabby cat was found with her kittens on the street. Now they have a home and a shelter. They're not stray anymore. Three months later, the mummy was spayed in a vet hospital. After the operation, she came back to her children. Good girl, take care of your babies. This dog Hansel got in a really weird situation. He was choking on a toy ball. Hansel was rescued and then fostered by an incredible family that fell madly in love with him. But just shortly after celebrating his adoption day, he choked on a toy ball. The whole vet team did their best for giving Hansel their second chance. Be careful with toy balls, young fella. This little fox definitely takes the award for the weirdest rescue of the year. This poor fox had chased a mouse into a flower pot and had managed to get her head stuck in the process. The fox was there for a few hours with her head inside it. At least she wouldn't bite. The people carefully pulled the fox's head out of the flower pot and there we are, the fox was free. Unfortunately, the mouse had not escaped the fox. The fox escaped remarkably unscathed and without any serious injuries. You can go home now, baby. Someone found this poor kitten in very bad condition. On the next day, the rescuers headed out to the place. He looked like he was barely alive. The baby was paralyzed. Rescuers took him to the vet. He got some medical treatment there. He didn't eat or drink for a long time. Just imagine how hungry he was. He also got a lot of medication. He doesn't like it like other kids, as well as eye drops. Welcome home. After three weeks, he looks much more healthy. Also, he started to walk on all four legs a little bit. After a year and a half, he was fully recovered. He enjoys his new life. His new family named him Tigo. Bye, Tigo. Look at this big group of rescuers. What are they doing in this storm drain? Look, they pulled a small black kitten out of there. It's a real mystery how the baby got there. Maybe he was chasing the mouse? Thank goodness all these dangerous adventures are finished. A kitten got itself into an unusual situation. Only God knows how and why this little kitten was stuck in this hole. People noticed this poor and lonely baby just in time. The weather was so hot and the baby was starting to get dehydrated. Rescuers brought some non-toxic mineral oil to lube the baby's head. People carefully put some oil around his head and tried to pull him out. And finally, the baby was safe. Oh my god, you did it! Oh, I'm so proud of you! Oh my goodness! The medical staff took a look and he will be available for adoption or foster soon. He got shocked and stressed a lot, but the adventure was done with. This puppy was found all alone on a rainy, cold day. The puppy was very scared, dirty, frozen, and very hungry. In the car driving to the vet, he didn't move. There were several disgusting flies and huge ticks over his body. His situation looks very bad, but the vets are doing everything necessary to save his life. No animal deserves this. So now he has a hope. No animal should be in this situation, so he will remain in the clinic as long as needed. Unfortunately, after two days in the clinic, this poor puppy lost the battle for life. Rest in peace, beautiful baby.
a man noticed a deer had gotten stuck in the mud in the nearby lake. The man waited out with the canoe to see what he could do. He got to the deer and managed to calm her down. He also attempted to get her unstuck, but the poor deer proceeded to run right back into the mud. But fortunately, later he was able to get her back in the canoe. So this kind man got the deer back towards land. But she jumped out of the canoe and into the mud again! Oh, no! This time he used rope and was able to get her back to the edge of the lake where the mud wasn't as deep. The next morning she was still there. When the man checked on her, she jumped up and took off. The deer looked to be fine. Best of luck, honey! This poor cat got stuck under the iron door of a garage. How could he get there? Kind people rushed up to help them. They rattled their instruments loudly. The cat was just in shock. After the successful release, he promptly ran away. The kitty was really stressed. You're welcome, buddy. Rescuers on kayaks found a seal on the beach with a big bundle of lines. It was a big girl. She was scratching herself because of the hooks and lines. It was really necessary to help her. It can be dangerous for her and other seals around her. There was also a hook in her mouth. Rescuers had quite a few of them lately. Luckily, the barbs have been pressed in again, which we're really happy about. That's fantastic to see going from such a situation to back in the wild as the healthiest ever. This is a short story about a deer that got stuck in a fence. A kind man noticed her and helped her. She looked really hurt. After realizing, the deer ran away so fast to reunite with her family. The department search and rescue and air units rescued two hikers and a dog that had heat-related issues. In this case, all three could not walk out of the area on their own, so they were airlifted out, including the dog who goes by the name Whiskey. The hikers and dog are all doing fine now. Look at this dramatic dog rescue. The poor boy drowned in a river. That was an extreme rescue mission. The wind and water stream was so strong. The previous rescuer couldn't save the doggy, so firefighters came to save both of them. After that, they managed to rescue the dog with special equipment. The dog was confused, but safe and happy to be released. How? How could the poor cat get under the paving stones? In Belgorod, workers heard meowing under the laid paving stones. Wasting no time, the workers began to dismantle the part where the kitten was buried. Finally, they took the screaming baby out of the ground. You are saved, kitty. This large female giraffe probably was walking around the pool and had fallen into it. People came together to help this poor animal. The girl started to be nervous when people came closer. One man jumped right into the pool and 14 other people were trying to pull out the giraffe. After, five more people joined. So it was a whole crowd that tried to help the giraffe. They all used their strength. Finally, the giraffe was out of the pool. The next step was to turn her out and put the girl in a right position. The giraffe suddenly stood up and ran away to freedom. You're welcome, honey! Rescuers were told about a stray dog in very bad condition. They arrived as fast as possible. The picture was just terrible. The dog couldn't move at all. The situation was extremely difficult. Ermoini, the rescuer, didn't stop supporting him and calming him. The vet made all the necessary treatment. He must fight to live. But unfortunately, the dog didn't make it. 
Unfortunately, people were informed too late and were unable to save her no matter how hard they tried. This red girl's name is Dream. She miraculously survived. The fire at the Enterprise was extinguished for more than six hours. All this time, baby Dream was suppressed. This is what she looked like immediately after release, disoriented and poisoned. She was on such medium critical condition. The medical treatment is now completed and the girl is looking for a new home. And there's already a family from Poland who want to adopt the pretty Dream. Rescuers found Kav Rish collapsed and half starved. He was abandoned to fend for himself in a world of boundary walls, fences, roads full of cars and garbage. Kind rescuers scooped him up and brought him back to life with food and snuggles. The poor boy desperately missed his mother, who's probably broken hearted for missing him. This is a really heartwarming picture. People brought him to the vet. Fortunately, his bones were not injured. So he went through rehab and look at him now. He's eating fresh grass and hanging out with his new cow family. Also, Rish receives a lot of love from people and his new siblings. After another shelling in the Ukrainian city of Mykolaiv, one Labrador was left in one of the apartments. The poor buddy was waiting for help. He missed his owner so much. The rescue mission wasn't easy at all. The Labrador didn't want to climb into the crane cabin. The boy was confused and nervous. But luckily, everything was all right. Now the dog and his owner are reunited and happy. Dog Rescue Shelter got a call to rescue a dog from a manhole. Thanks to the man for the call and the assistance. This man takes care of four street dogs and one of them was lost. After two days, he finally found him because the dog was howling. They went down for the dog using the wood stairs. The poor dog was very stressed and scared. But luckily, rescuers were able to take the poor dog up. The vet checked the dog and decided that she is totally all right. Happy ending for the dog. Officers were on patrol when they noticed that a dog got off his leash and jumped into the water. The dog then began to panic. The water was extremely cold, so rescuers immediately began rescue efforts. One officer jumped into the water in an attempt to save the dog. That's risky. With the assistance of the officers on board the marine unit, the dog was safely pulled up from the water. Fortunately, the baby was not injured. The owner was just walking with her dog when her dog decided to break free from that leash and jump headfirst into the water. Two-year-old Loki is lucky to be back in his owner's arms, safe and sound, and outside of the cold water. This magpie had crash-landed in a dried-up pond before getting thoroughly covered in sediment unable to move and at real risk of drowning. This poor bird stuck on the mud in the middle of one of those ponds. Everything was in mud. Rescuers immediately cleaned the baby from his eyes and his mouth. That was quite a lucky escape considering how deep all that mud was. Now the bird looks pretty clean and calmed down. It was quite a stressful procedure. Wait for the feathers to re-waterproof and then hopefully can head back to the world. So it's freedom time for the magpie. Bye bye, fella. This family noticed a baby moose right on the road. This baby moose was stranded on the shoulder of a busy highway and a deep swamp. What would you do in this situation? And what will be the fate of our new little friend? The boy picked the baby up. The little moose was crying and calling for his mother. Poor kid. Whoa, this is crazy. She she had a baby. Okay. That could cause a big accident, and that's why people needed to move him. The poor baby was not going to survive if he stayed there. So these kind people brought him to a safer location. And that moose's story had a happy ending. The next day, a mom with two calves was noticed nearby. Probably this mom will adopt the baby, and now she will care about him as if he were her own child. That's a happy baby. Three unlucky dogs got trapped in an icy river. There was a layer of thin ice then, about six foot of slush under it that made it a very tough rescue. Look how difficult it was. One by one, all the dogs were moved to solid ground. Now all three dogs are safe and healthy. 
Thanks so much to this hero, who rescued all of them. This story is about a poor dog stuck in a chamber. The girl was there for three days due to a flash flood. Look at this disgusting place. Because of the heavy water current, the poor fellow moved to this huge pipe and got stuck there. It was a quite difficult rescue mission, but after some effort of the whole rescue team, the dog was saved. Be careful, princess! This poor dog was also found in a basement of a destroyed building. The baby was so stressed. Now this little dog is safe. Rescuers also found a cat in a broken building. He was so scared and nervous. <laughs> Rescuers handily put him into a carrier and brought him to safety. It's all right, baby. Another white cat was waiting for rescuers on a balcony. Look at this broken house. The cat was hiding in a corner. Her scared eyes tell a lot. Poor baby. Everything's gonna be all right now. An unfortunate deer got in a high mountain river. Look at this fabulous action by a whitewater kayaker. He saved this poor deer from drowning while paddling with friends. The funny part is he cares almost more about the deer than his fellow paddlers who had to swim. So the deer was successfully moved to the shore. A girl with multicolored hair pulls dogs with disabilities out of a broken urban, and millions of people around the world asked the same question. Who is she and what happened to the girl and her dogs? Anastasia Taika and her husband took out 15 dogs with disabilities during the evacuation from Irpin. Anastasia specializes in fostering of sick animals for about four years. The peaceful life was interrupted by the war. In the early days of the war, during the shelling, dogs were very nervous. One day, the electricity, gas, and water was turned off and more shelling began. Then they decided to evacuate with all the dogs. When they crossed the bridge, everyone helped to carry the dogs. But in this chaos, her dog Zuizia ran away. They began to periodically go to Irpin and look for abandoned and locked up animals. Now Anastasia takes care of these animals. She provides them with medical care and keeps them until an owner is found. The dogs were very tired. Some could barely walk. Anastasia and her husband took only those who walk alone and bit strangers. Besides the dogs, Anastasia took out from Irpin five cats and her pets, chameleon and a turtle. All these creatures deserve to live, and Anastasia saved all of them like a hero. <laughs> Firefighters rescued a dog from a house fire. They came just in time and were able to save the dog's life. The doggy came back to his owner. It was really heartwarming. One of the craziest rescue missions that we have seen. A rescuer received an alert about a dog and her two pups being left on a property. The mom was locked outside with nowhere to go. She was walking in the ice-cold floodwaters and getting hypothermia. Her puppies were trapped inside the house in the state of an emergency flood. Poor babies. And this is where she's been for the past 24 hours during the floods, freezing cold and away from her babies. 30 minutes walking in ice-cold water, slight hypothermia, but totally worth it. Because now, they're saved. Off they begin on their new journey with their foster families. Welcome to the new life. People found these abandoned kittens under the wooden desk. They were scared, covered in poo and mud. They were almost black babies, but the one was white. It's like mama ran out of ink on that one little guy. The last baby was very far under the desk. The rescuer had spent about an hour trying to get him to come to her and nothing was working. The rescuer decided to leave this baby and mama and let them distress. That means that mom is going to take really good care of this one kitten. The mom is still around. She was still taking care of that one kitten. They would love to be able to catch her, give her a home and some medical care. Mama Kitty and her other seven kittens hopefully will be reunited if the rescue team can get her caught. So this cat family has a great, safe, and prosperous future. Another story is about this baby fox. 
This baby was constantly calling out in the garden, but there was no sign of mom. They discovered that the mom did not return that night. The fox cub made a quick dart from the den and got tangled in football netting. Normally a disaster, but it helped us retrieve the fox cub with ease. People will care about you, baby. Arnia lived in the yard of a rundown garage. She was in a heartbreaking condition. She was freezing on such a cold day. Arnia is one of the four dogs who was rescued from that garage yard. The poor girl was severely anemic, dehydrated, and underweight. And she was so exhausted that she only wanted to sleep. After one month, she has made a beautiful recovery. Not only a healthy recovery, but also all the joy and happiness she missed before. She's approximately two to three years old, but has the spirit of a little puppy. She loves to jump and play with joy. She's the happiest dog now. Volunteers had an unusual call, as they launched to rescue a cat stranded on a riverbank. The crew made the best speed to the location. However, just prior to the lifeboat's arrival, the cat fell into the river and was immediately spotted by the crew on board the lifeboat as it came round the corner. The lifeboat crew pulled the soggy moggy out of the water onto the lifeboat and wrapped it into a warm blanket. He seemed pleased to see rescuers. Once on dry land, he was given some salmon from the fish shop, which he enjoyed. Look at this wet poor fellow. He's now back home safe and sound. People received a call about a bear that was stuck in a grain bin. The curious bear really needed to climb up there. After deliberation, rescuers tried something out of the ordinary, using a ladder, ratchet straps, and a few logs. The poor fellow was able to escape about an hour after people left. Go back to your wildlife, boy. My heart was in my mouth when I saw this video. People saw the poor dog running blindly down the road. The poor girl had been dumped and was so confused. Laura was trying to stop the cars, but they ignored both of them. Laura prayed she would wait, and she did. She knew Laura wanted to help. You're safe now, sweetheart. It could have ended so differently. Now she is so loved and wanted. An abandoned seventh baby swan was found. Their parents left him alone. A man who found him cleaned him up and named him Seven. Look how this swan has grown all this time with the care of this man. These kind people grew him like their own child. He became bigger and much more beautiful. When he came to be nine months old, Seven and his brother are ready to live on their own. This lake will be their new home. His human parents will miss him so much. Goodbye, beautiful swans. A cat was rescued in Borodyanka. The poor baby had been sitting for many days on the seventh floor of a house destroyed by hives. The cat was sitting on a fragment of the floor in the former apartment of a destroyed high-rise building. The poor fellow had no chance to get down on his own. Ukrainian rescuers drove from another city in a truck ladder that was necessary for saving the cat. They removed the poor thing from the height. The whole operation took not much time, and the very next day the cat was rescued. Rescuers were so happy to help this poor little buddy. It's so heartwarming when people see a lonely cat in a completely destroyed house and sound the alarm. And now, the kitty is saved. A distressed dog was rescued from a sweltering hot car. Police officers were forced to smash the vehicle's window. The rescue team was called after the Shih Tzu was spotted panting heavily and barking for help. The poor small Shih Tzu was barking and panting inside of the locked car. The windows were left slightly open, but it was not enough to prevent the dog from collapsing. Rescuers carried the puppy into shade and gave him water. The baby was so thirsty. Wow, it was really a hard experience for this little fella. People heard a strange sound coming from the sewer drain. They spent a few hours digging and tried different things to get it out until finally the little creature showed up, and it was just a baby raccoon. Animal Control asked if somebody would take him home and care for him until he found a better place. The tiny raccoon was so sweet and cute at home, also really hungry and tired. And later, they found the perfect place for him to continue his little life. 
Bye bye, baby. A young fox cub had accidentally fallen over a well, a six foot dip into a stream. The baby was cold, frightened, and stressed. The rescuer wrapped him in a warm towel. While rescuing the youngster was an easy task, locating him in the right direction would have proven difficult. If they put him on the wrong side, he's not going to find his mom. The rescuers met a neighbor. He told about the fox family of at least two adults and three cubs. It helped a lot. Let's get you back to your mom, young sir. 